Howie the dog, please report to the front desk. Howie the dog. Octo, what's wrong? Didn't you get my text? You've been texting me? For years. Oh, I only use this thing for the Giggle app. <laughs> now, let's see here. Noisy guest, blah, blah, blah. Fire in the toilet, blah, blah, blah. Complaints about manager's hygiene. Oh, here's your latest. Today is Needle Day. Needle Day? Why? Haven't you heard? There's a very nasty bug going around. Sour bum flatuosis. Sour bum flatuosis? It's a virus that causes extreme, uh, flatulence. Who's a whatulence? Basically, a really stinky, non-stop, week-long... Don't cry for me, dudes. It's too late. Save yourselves! Third floor, please. <laughs> a week-long toot? Howie, this is serious! Right, serious. <laughs> Funny app, dude. Okay, but do we really need to get a needle? Come on, Howie. Show a little backbone, baby. It's only a needle. Here, watch how a fearless fella does it. Let's get this hypodermic hoedown started. Grab him and jab him, baby. That's weird. It's almost like you're looking forward to this. Can't wait. Impale the whale. Who's giving us these needles anyway? The public health squad is sending over a registered nurse. That must be them now. <laughs> nurse Duck is here. Bend over. Duck. You're a registered nurse? Since when? Since I got this hat and this big bag of needles. Now bend over. You're gonna give us our needles? And then I will give you a lollipop. A lollipop? Be first! Come on, guys. He must be a professional. They don't give those hats out to just anybody. I have just the head for you. I guess so. Perfect. Now, Octo is first. Well, actually... What's the matter? Scared? Let's just get this over with. Do not worry. This will be totally painless. Okay, if you say so. Yeah! Ow! You said it would be painless! I did not feel a thing. There is your lollipop. Next patient, please. Ow! <laughs> Chops of steel. Bomb still stingy, though. Let a pro show you all how it's done. 100% prime behind. Hit me with your best shot. Say cheese. <laughs> ha! Didn't feel a thing. Guess all those years of performing have given me a thick... Mm. Oh, no! You must already have sour bomb flatuosis. Gobbledygook. I feel fine. You don't smell any worse than usual. Raggy Chingy thinks Bomb Bomb shrinking. Is that my beach ball? Now, how did that get there? Narwhal, are you afraid of needles? What? Howie, baby. No! What gave you that wackadoodle idea? Everyone, quick, look over there! Fake Bomb Bomb thing vanish into thick air. He's like a magician. All right, guys, it's time to needle the Narwhal. Who's with me? I am medium rare. Good enough. Uh, shake it in. Watch with me. Do it in. Uh, see the fin. This is my fin. Who's got a new fin? Narwhal's got a new fin, baby. Out of my blowhole. I'm out of my blowhole. Dorsal dancing. Dorsal time. Not your head. Diddle dee dow, dee dee dow. What's this? Someone left a hand mirror on the ground. Come here, you. Huh? Hmm. Hello, you magnificent beast. All right, duck. No! It was all a clever trap. What was that? I thought we would never get you. Here is your lollipop. Hooray! Hey, Narwhal. Ah! 
<laughs> Wanna play a game of musical chairs? Howie, don't insult me. Everyone knows chairs don't make music. No, no, no. It's a game. The music starts. And when it stops, the first one of us to sit down wins. Yeah! Seems lame, How Dog. I'll pass. Oh! Come on, Narwhal. Why don't you just let Duck give you the needle? Why don't you just let Duck give you the needle? He already did. Several times. Right. Great, then. You'll be healthy enough for the both of us. Everyone, quick, look over there! We really gotta stop falling for that. Narwhal! We have a delicious, non-threatening birthday cake for you to sit on! Narwhal! It's okay, Narwhal. Narwhal! It won't hurt you to miss a few dozen shows. <laughs> what am I saying? I won't survive another 20 minutes without the love of a crowd. And it's hardly fair for my adoring fans to go so long without my silvery tones and rugged good looks. On second thought, I'll just stay away from the hotel until this whole sour bum flatuosis thing blows over. Literally! <laughs> wow, seems like everybody is starting to come down with sour bum flatuosis. And Narwhal's nowhere to be found. He might be hiding from us. But he's a performer. He has to perform. Maybe not here, but somewhere. So where would he go for his usual dose of love and adoration? Anywhere there's a crowd. That's where we'll find him. Come on! You are safe now. Yes, there was a guy with a horn coming out of his head here a while ago, singing. I tried to tell him we're an artificial eye supply store, but he insisted on doing a number. Shim dim, looking at the eyes, looking at the eyes, 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 eyes. Dilly wop to dow, dilly wop. I'm so creeped out right now. I told them we was just trying to make pizzas. Hoochie wop, dilly wop, dilly wop, dilly wop. How, 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 how? Spatula, keep that applause coming. One more number, I'd love to. I'm happy to sing a while. Just to get your special smile. Whip, whap, wibbly wow, yeah. Um, not well. Not now, Howie. When they're grinning, that means I'm a winning. He understands this is a dentistry school, right? Narwhal, come on back to the Banana Cabana. Where we have real audiences. And a real big needle. That's not helping, Howie. I'm just saying, the needle hurt a lot. I mean, like, terrible, searing pain. But only for a moment. Although the memory of the pain will probably stay with you forever. Fellas, I'm going to make a confession. For real this time. Whatever you do, if he suddenly points somewhere, don't look. It's not just the pain I'm trying to avoid. It's just when I was a young lad growing up. I had two brothers. We lived in a very small apartment, always in each other's way. I was always getting poked by their horns. Every day, every night. The poking, the poking. Pokety, 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 poke. Ow! Sorry but I believe I made my point. Right, you hate being poked. Me too, if anyone's interested. Nope, not in the slightest. Anyway, I miss having a real audience more than I hate being poked. So, for the sake of the gang, I will tough it out and let Duck give me the shot. Well, the good news is, when it's all over, you get a lollipop. Can I have your lollipop? No. You're very brave, Narwhal. Very brave. Can't watch! Oh, not again. I cannot watch either. Oops. We have one small problem. I am out of needles. What? So I'm going to catch sour bum flatuosis? No. You will just have to take a spoonful of this very tasty syrup instead. Really? Deal. What? We could have just taken a syrup? Mmm. <laughs> Mm, delicious! That glides right down. Works even better than the needle. Then why didn't you give us the syrup? Because it was needle day? Duh. Well, at least it all worked out for the best. Gesundheit! Um, Doc, did you 
Peach, remember to give yourself a needle. No. Why do you ask? Blind by Excuse me? What was that, Howie? I said, I love a good watermelon eating contest. Oh, you said it. Friends, animals, lend me your ears. What did he say? He wants your ears? Well, he's not going to get his hands on these beauties. Welcome to the 347th Annual Watermelon Gurgitating Showdown. Meet your competitors, Piggy and Yeti! Start your saliva gland! I really should start selecting my gigs more carefully. Pardon me, Pig. But is that really the best you can do? That Yeti sure knows how to put on a show. Oh no! He's got it! Piggy! Piggy, are you in here? Piggy! Piggy! Oh, hey, Piggy. Go away! Oh, come on. There's nothing to be embarrassed about. You know how many times I, as former gurgitating champion, barfed on everyone in town? Dozens. Dozens of dozens. Anyway, point is, there's nothing to... Wait, what was the point? This must be where the losers hang out. <laughs> what are you doing here, Yeti? I just came by to thank Piggy. That was by far the easiest victory I've ever had. Hey, hey, hey! You can't talk to my friend like that! Oh, really, Howie? What are you going to do about it? Well, it just so happens I was once regional speed gurgitating champion myself. So? So, Howie, the gurgitation sensation, is coming out of retirement and bringing that championship belt back to the banana cabana where it belongs. And why should I waste my time competing against the former champ? Well, if you beat me, you can say you beat the bestest gurgitator of all time. Hardly worthwhile. What else do you have? This old half-finished bottle of nasal spray? Ooh, pass. You can have... Piggy Scoop! Deal! What? Not Piggy Precious Scoop! Why not just give away Piggy's heart? I'm going to enjoy the satisfaction that digging things out of my nose with your scoop shall bring me. And I'll consider it a bonus that I also get to humiliate you in the process, Howard. Good day. <laughs> Howard, that is such a weird name. Hey! Why don't they not training for competition? What? Competition. Piggy not going to lose scoop. Piggy train dog right now. I will absolutely start training right after the Dirk Danger Dangerous Danger Time Marathon finishes in 72 hours. So cancel. Or we could start now. <laughs> One. Eighty-eight. Dog thing weak as puppy. Must do better. That is it, Howie. Feel the burn. Run, lazy dog thing. Run! Dog thing, don't stop! Kid, run! Any! This will be like taking candy from a baby. Give it your best shot.
see how easy it is for him to compete with his mouth glued shut. <laughs> 76 days straight without brushing my teeth. World record, here I come. Hmm. Huh? There's nothing I enjoy more than brushing my teeth. <laughs> huh, that backfired. Ooh, they have a loofah. Ah. This last watermelon will certainly help you go out with a bag. <gasps> it's not even my birthday. <laughs> this dog thinks best time yet. Maybe Piggy no lose scoop to Big Smelly Foot. Smelly Foot? But I just had a bath. You can count on me, Pigasaurus. Nothing to work. Uh, I feel kind of funny. Um. That was you, right? Hey, Piggy, what's with the contraption, my thingy? Is it a time machine? Oh, oh, tell me it's a time machine. No, it's to stretch belly. One round tonight and one tomorrow before competition. Dog thing, say ah. Uh... <laughs> one more round of this before the competition, eh? Well, Howard, your next round is going to make you very round. <laughs> A few adjustments and voila! Wouldn't want Howie to enter the contest on an empty stomach. <laughs> One last load of watery melons. Melons from the past, right, Piggy? Yes, time melons. No! So many melons! What year is this? Nothing! Get up! Must win Piggy School! Oh no. Piggy? Yeah, me too. Would you look at that? The competition starts in five minutes. Piggy, not going to lose school. But we'll never make it in time. We make it. Think we can stop for ice cream? No. Move it, banana bread. You're going the wrong way. Piggy car! Don't think spewing this! Um, how many of these do you have? Oh. <laughs> Sorry, folks! If Howie's not here in exactly 4.3 seconds, we're gonna have to cancel. Don't think here! Don't think here! Yay, Howie! Looking great, Howie! Oh. Well, Howard, it appears I made your training more fulfilling. <laughs> what? Smelly foot do this? Of course, pig. Dog thing will beat you. Or else! Competitors, grab your melons! Taking my scoop now. And your belt. Ha ha ha, yes. Scoopy? Oh, come on! Huh? That was.
wasn't sanitary. And the new champion is... Howie! What? No! Piggy, we did it! How about a hug? No way! Something too icky and gross! Howie! 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 Anybody else hungry? 